I'll never be the same person I was before I lost Kinsey. But Kinsey has inspired me to be a better person, a better mother, and she's inspired me to change the lives of children. My dream was in 2007 after I lost Kinsey was to heal and to make a difference in the lives of other children in our community who are less fortunate because I knew Kinsey would have gotten a new doll and all I wanted to do was put a smile on some little girl's face because I couldn't do that for my own child. This is how I honor Kinsey every year at our toy shop. The smiling faces of the underprivileged children, the families that don't have to make a choice between putting food on their table or paying their bills and that these children get a new toy because so many children never get a new toy. And I believe that every child, regardless of your circumstances, where you were born, how much money your parents make or do not make, that every child deserves a new toy. So Kinsey's memory inspires me to do the toy shop every year. Since 2007, we have provided more than 14,000 new toys to children in our community. And those are families that either would have not had toys or they would have had secondhand toys and these children have new toys. This year our goal is to serve 3,000 children and we want each of these 3,000 children to be pro provided with a new toy, a new stocking stuffer, a new book, and a toothbrush brush and toothpaste kit. When our doors open, every toy shop and those families come through and they wrap their presents and I see these kids smile and these families smile. There's nothing in the world that's more precious than that and there's no amount of money that would allow me to walk away from that. I'll always be a part of Dolls for Daughters. Even when I'm 90 years old, I may be the lady checking you in at the table, but I'll always be there and Dolls for Daughters will still be around and we will still be giving back to kids in our local community who otherwise would go without.